Ross Edgley may become everyone's new best friend after he recently demonstrated that gaining weight doesn't have everything to do with fat. The 28-year-old sport scientist and writer did an experiment to prove that your nutrition and self-esteem shouldn't be governed by the weighing scales if you're on a diet. So many people are slaves to the scales and have their self-esteem and nutrition governed by them. I hope this experiment will create a healthier relationship between people and the weighing scales and people will realize weight can fluctuate based on many factors, not just fat. The scientist's extreme experiment had him trying to lose 14 kilograms in no more than 24 hours. Keep in mind that this was a dangerous experiment that was done under the doctor's strict supervision, so do not try this at home. Edgley's main goal was that of losing as much water as possible. As much as 50% to 70% of our body weight is made up of water. So weighing 95 kilograms that means in theory 47.5 kilograms of my body is water weight. Cutting too much water could be fatal since it's needed for your vital organs to function and even maintain a healthy blood volume but cutting a lot of water from the body through sweatsuits, diuretics and not drinking any that day would dramatically reduce my weight, he explains. To force the water out of his system, he began his 24-hour experiment by taking a very hot bath with Epsom salt baths. He drank a bit of water spiced with diuretics, vitamin C, dandelion root, caffeine. He didn't include carbs nor salt in his diet, Salt is known to retain water. He took saunas and went to the gym. By doing that, he managed to lose the 12 kilograms and feel a little lightheaded as a result. Since the lost weight was just water, he put it back in just a couple of hours after he had reached his target. Although the method is dangerous and unpleasant, Edgley succeeded in proving his point that weighing yourself is an inaccurate measure of body fat and self esteem. Here are a few excerpts from the diary he held during those 24 hours.